Satan just want to use you. Ο σατανάς θέλει να σε χρησιμοποιήσει. To destroy your life. Για να καταστρέψει τη ζωή σου. And also destroy other people's life. Και τις ζωές άλλων ανθρώπων. And and this has been happening for a long time now. Και αυτό συμβαίνει εδώ και καιρό τώρα. Not that you you have not tried. Δεν είναι ότι δεν έχεις προσπαθήσει. Να βγεις από αυτό. But immediately you try to come out. Αλλά κάθε φορά που προσπαθείς. Something will just come and push you back. Κάτι έρχεται και σε ξανασπρώχνουν ξανά στα ίδια. And you become worse than before. Και γίνεσαι χειρότερος από πριν, χειρότερα. As you are now. Όπως είσαι τώρα. You are just only you. Είσαι μόνος, μόνο εσύ. Alone. Clock. Μόνος σου. True. So Είναι this, αλήθεια, ναι. This loneliness Αυτή η μοναξιά can cause you to do anything. μπορεί να σε προκαλέσει να κάνεις το οτιδήποτε. As if you, you don't want to live anymore. Σαν να μην θέλεις να ζεις άλλο. But I want you to know that Jesus Christ loves you. Αλλά θέλω να ξέρεις ότι ο Ιησούς Χριστός σε αγαπάει. And he wants to give you another chance. Και θέλει να σου δώσει μια άλλη ευκαιρία. If you are ready, Αν είσαι mm-hmm. έτοιμος, Follow him. Να τον ακολουθήσεις. He wants to give you a new life. Θέλει να σου δώσει μια νέα ζωή. So you're coming here to Greece. Έτσι το ερχομός εδώ στην Ελλάδα. Should not be just a holiday. Δεν πρέπει να είναι απλά για διακοπές. But something more. Πρέπει να είναι κάτι παραπάνω. This is the place where you should drop your old life. Εδώ πρέπει να αφήσεις την παλιά σου ζωή. And as you're walking out of this door. Και καθώς βγαίνεις από αυτή την πόρτα. You are walking out a new person. Γένεις έξω ένας νέος άνθρωπος. So, honor Jesus Christ. Για αυτό τιμά τον Ιησού Χριστό. Honor Jesus. Τιμά τον Ιησού Χριστό. And He will lift you up. Και κοινώς θα σε υψώσει. Your life will never be the same. Η ζωή σου δεν θα είναι ποτέ ξανά ίδια. Αμήν. And two. Και δεύτερον. The spirit of death. Το πνεύμα του θανάτου is, is chasing you. Σε κυνηγάει. Ναι, το ξέρω. Θέλει να σε σκοτώσει. Let me pray for you. The mighty name of Jesus. Στο πατοδύναμο όνομα του Ιησού. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. Στο πατοδύναμο όνομα του Ιησού Χριστού. In the mighty name of Jesus. Στο πατοδύναμο όνομα του Ιησού Χριστού. Lord Jesus. Κύριε Ιησού. Accept him as your child. Δέξου τον ως παιδί σου. In Jesus Christ's name. Στο όνομα του Ιησού Χριστού. In Jesus name. Στο όνομα του Ιησού Χριστού. Thank you, Lord. Σε ευχαριστώ, Κύριε. In Jesus name. Amen. Στο όνομα του Ιησού Χριστού. So you are free. Yeah. Είσαι ελεύθερος. I am Hetian, coming from Holland. During the prayer line, we saw the man of God coming to you and giving you a word of prophecy. Can you please tell us what did the man of God tell you at that time? Um, he told me that I'm not on vacation here. That's right, because I'm here to get set free by the man of God. And he told me that I live in isolation. That's true, because of the addiction I have, I'm struggling with. And he told me that uh, the spirit of death is haunting me. And that's really true, because I'm struggling to stay alive and uh, to get free. I isolate myself because I don't want people nearby that drink alcohol and use hard drugs. So I live in isolation just to be safe and then struggling to don't get um, distracted or yeah, that people offer you things. So it's better to be alone than with a whole bunch of people doing the wrong things. I don't see my father, my mother, my brother. I don't see nobody. I have two children. I don't see them, no. I'm all alone. When I was born, my father was a heavily drinker. My mother got pregnant from a man who is heavily drinker and abusing her, uh, slapping her. So I was not um, like, uh, you don't like to be pregnant from, from a man who is drinking and beat you. So he's trying to destroy my life ever since when I was born. 
and I started smoking weed when I was 12, drinking when I was 17, using cocaine when I was 19, sniffing first. On my 20th, I started smoking crack, and ever since I've been doing that. When I am under the influence of uh, alcohol and drugs, I'd, <laughs> I keep sinning. And uh, yeah, it's hard to do. When I don't have money, I don't go steal or... I just do it for my income, the money I have. And when I have no money, I'm happy. I don't do all these things. But when money come, something come in my head and I start drinking and then boom, the rest of the things will come on. Yeah. Do you believe that this word of prophecy has brought blessing and breakthrough and deliverance in your life? Yes, I believe that because I want to get cut loose from the darkness and just be safe, live a holy life without sin. But I can only do that with Jesus. I cannot do it on my own. So I always say in prayer, Father, help me. I cannot do it alone. You mean that you know that you're free? I know I'm free. I am free in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ and his blood shed on the cross. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So what would be your promise to God Almighty for what he has done for you? I will dedicate my life. I, I will say, Father, take my, my, my thoughts, my, my soul, my life, my body. I, I, I will... Say, take it all in your hand and where you want me to be, I will be there. Use me to be a blessing for other people. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.